Hello viewers, it's the me and team. Welcome to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 3. We left off with three towns and a uh, capital and uh, a crippling of Tan. So we're just going to have to look for Tan's final city. Maybe force him to attack us. Uh, maybe just run him down and kill him as necessary. But once again, not going to buy anything here. Not going to give him the chance to actually use it against me. Just go there. Oh, that's right, you are going to take mines. It's nice having mines, especially since I really couldn't find my own proper London Burr Mill. Uh, to take that one was handy. Uh, I should check out the Witch's Hut. Diplomacy is useful. I might, I might pick that up, actually. With my main. I know Flobbing Donkey will probably yell at me for doing that, but I like diplomacy, and not just in Festival of Life. Although, I really, really, really wish I could have had it in Festival of Life. Because it would have made the game a lot simpler. But, nope. Woe be to me, I could not do it. Okay, so he, he walked back into the city. We couldn't really recruit anything. And didn't buy any extra defenses. So, it doesn't really matter that he got into the city. And I'm going to have to economize on this slow. Actually, I still want it first. Because now I can hit his shooters before he can hit mine. And yikes. Oh man. I'm so happy he only has five spell palliants. <laughs> Bad things happen, viewers, when somebody who has a meteor shower specialty gets his hands on you. But I uh, know that's just not going to be the problem this time. Do I have enough for blast? Do I have enough for. <laughs> it's better than nothing. I can do uh, a lot or not sufficient damage here. But I really don't want to like just move in there next to the troglodytes when their numbers are in the, when they're in those kinds of numbers. Ow. <laughs> yeah, we'd be slow there, harpies. Yeah, I'll still be down on the troglodytes a little bit. Very nice. And we will... Yep, we've breached the castle. Forts are really lame. They don't do much. Well, I no longer outspeed. And I'm completely out of spell points. So we're just going to have to work with it. Gotcha. <sighs> offense, on the other hand, offense is good too. These are good abilities. They're nice to have. And I think, since we're talking about an overlord here, it's just nice to have you air. But I, I think it's better to actually pump up the creature stats a bit. And having skills like offense and armor, especially when you're talking about a hero who isn't really getting a lot of raw stats... I think it's worth it. I think it's worth my time to invest in that. So, a couple of new spells maybe. I don't know. It doesn't matter. That's really not why I got that. <laughs> oh, he did. He bought a Medusa thing. For all the good that did him. I have money? Yes. Might as well build up my hometown. Can't hurt. What were you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Sucks you out of darkness. Lemma can just stay there. Cursed ground. Yeah, sure, you're not actually going to be fighting, so... Oh, man. <laughs> really not, not what I was looking for, I'm afraid. <laughs> not that it really hurts to get that. I guess it's just a random secondary hero, but not not the most useful outcome. Gotta say, that that's kinda useless. And unless I can offer it up as a sacrifice for some experience points or something, although I have a feeling that I'm not going to be hurting for those either. But whatever.
You know... I really want to grab those pyramids. Oh, you know what? Actually, I have expert view Earth, so I can uh, I can get a picture of the land here. Let's go underground and see where this leads. Um, not really clear. Not really clear at all. I don't want to get stuck out here. Oh no, I wouldn't have to. I wouldn't have to be stuck. I would just... run straight south, I guess. Or I could go uh, east for green. Well, let's just say it depends on how broken of magic I get and roll with it. Not this turn, but we are going to enter the Cursed Pyramids next. Next turn. Why are you- what the heck? What kind of AI script does this? Am I missing something? Do I like lose if I let him buy? No. No, not really. What am I missing? Or I'll have it next turn. Pretty good in sulfur too. What does the dragon's lair cost? Mage guild level two as well. Not this week. I had to kill a scout today. He was whining about being outnumbered two to one. I overheard him talking and came up behind him. My form was excellent. I got a clean <laughs> the head with the head falling right off his body. I then explained two to one meant twice as much loot. <laughs> hey, that's a nice army when that kind of stuff's good for morale. And generally, when you kill your troops, they don't like it, but... Whatever. Yeah, I will. This is pretty much all you ever get in these things. Is, some um, golems. And golems take practically no damage from... Spells, but... Yeah, that doesn't matter, because they're still s completely susceptible to mass slow, and if you have shooters, well, that's game over. And they have decent stats, and they'll they'll rough me up. And apparently, I'm on the blessed ground or magical fairy, you know, land or something like that. So I can even cast things, all all my spells at expert level, including bless, which uh, dungeon troops have very high damage ranges, and uh, this will improve them significantly. Ah, uh, you suck. See, 304 damage. Um, still probably not good enough, though. Four hundred sixteen, sixty times. We will not one hit KO guaranteed, but it will rough them up. I still don't like it. I would like to not lose troops if possible. Hee <laughs> hee! 512 damage. Nope, it, it'll leave one alive. We'll wait. Yeah, now I can afford to attack those. 1.2k will easily trounce them. Oh, whatever, you guys stay put. This is good enough. Okay, now, um. Probably want to reestablish the mess slow. No point in waiting. And now, now we're just gonna basically hammer him down with shooters for a little bit. What's this? 50 times 30. Wow, 1500 hit points there. Can't say I like that situation. How am I on magic points? I'm alright. Out of shots. Of course I'd be out of shots. I'm gonna have to bite the bullet and attack them eventually. Oh good, full damage. Uh oh no, slow down. Uh 
Um. Let's see here. 737 damage. What are they at now? Um. Well, we'll just do 25 times 50. That's a little bit easier. It's still over a thousand. And, um... Well, we're just gonna do it this way. I'll lose some troglodytes, but not many. A little bit of caution. Ow. Oh. I could have had better. Although I suppose that wasn't terrible. So what's over here? I don't know if I'll get much out of a surprise attack. Oh yeah, I was going to take this. <laughs> I might be able to build up an army on my way over there. That would be fun. And if I don't, then Flobbing Donkey can just yell at me some more <laughs> for sucking at this game. <laughs> no, I'm not picking on you, actually. I'm picking on myself, because Flobbing Donkey, along with a couple others, have really... You guys have really helped me get better at this game. So, uh, yeah, actually keep it up. Because I've enjoyed the help immensely. It's made me a much better player. But, yeah, I'm going to call you out for helping me out. Yeah, you guys are doing good for me. I'll put it that way. Well... I don't like you either, Ranger. Do I care about this person? No, not really. You were sacrificial from the beginning. Although I should probably just run, since I'm not actually going to get any kills. And this is just wasting time. Wow, totally unnecessary cure. It's not like I'm actually going to do anything in terms of damage. Where, did, where is this happening? Lorelei. Lorelai's kind of cool, actually. I forget what her special is, but her name's cool enough. It's fine. Yeah, basic diplomacy. <laughs> so now we have two questionable <laughs> abilities. But you know what? We're still not bad, because we have uh, three of the very basic um, the basic might hero abilities. And then once I level those up, actually, is going to hit very hard with her creatures. We have Expert Slow. And if we can get an Expert Town Portal, potentially, or even some really nasty stuff. So, I, I, it's not too bad. It's, it's not too bad. Do I wish to pursue and engage the Oryx? Not particularly. I would love to take on the Dragon Utopia, but I would be, like, O-code by them. I just totally instant gibbed. Um, great. Welp, you're kind of stuck that direction. Back up you go! I wonder what happens if you repeat the visit the pyramids. Apparently, you can't. It seems like the AI doesn't, doesn't actually visit the pyramids. Maybe that's scripted. And Tan jacked the mine that I jacked off of Tan. Well, fair enough, I suppose. Ooh, one way entrance. <sighs> or do I want to just march on there on Green City here? Tempting. Let's try it. We'll own them with brute force and basic diplomacy in that order. Dragon Cave? No, I need this first. However, I have money, so you're going to stiffen the defenses in this area. <laughs> I said stiffen. Man, what is wrong with me? The Mianuendo and team. Um. I don't want to, like, let him run along the roads and take me out. I, I still don't know what Green's strategy in this game is. Yeah, although it, it certainly seems to be. Take some. Oh, I got shrouded. Eagle Eye. It certainly seems like his strategy is take some dudes and run to the spawning point of the human and do nothing. Which really does not make him seem high kill priority. And yeah, I'll build up some defenses here now. 
tiny chance of defending myself. I'm not really about getting my hopes up, but... Yeah, whatever. I have another week's worth of troops under my thumb there. So what happens if I search with you? <laughs> Bad luck. I think I destroyed her morale, too. <laughs> Sorry, Sephiroth. It's not a good time to be you. <laughs> I don't think it was in the last map, either. <laughs> uh, poor Sephiroth. I suppose I should recruit here, just in case uh, somebody shows up. Not that I would ever actually be able to defend, but... No, oh, maybe I can uh, do a meet-up in exchange. It's worth something, hopefully. I'm out of money. Earth elementals. How's my morale? I only have troops to two alignments. Huh. Hey, maybe I'll get lucky and just run in there next turn. Ooh, pack of minotaurs. Well, it depends. If he s recruits there, then I'll grab the pack of minotaurs first. If he doesn't, well, I'll just uh, run into the city and take a freebie. Get to fight the guards for that, unfortunately. Oh yeah, you were uh, going to meet up. We'll continue on with that plan. And probably swing by eventually to uh, get back to my original spawning location. Pick up more troops. Eventually I'll do a split. Okay, he summoned some stuff. Nah. Not particularly important to pursue and engage. You don't get a lot of experience, and I don't think I'm going to have trouble hitting the cap. Will that counteract my pyramid search? Who knows? Will this make it harder for the AI to take the city? Yep. So we're going to do that. And hey, now I have a chance to uh, do a little reunion. Really? I can see just that. That's the kind of thing where you just wonder if the map designers did that on purpose just to be funny. It's like, yeah, we'll leave this one little spot revealed even if they use the cover of darkness. Just to see who notices. Yeah, it's not important. It doesn't change the map at all. But yeah, just this little dot. Just in case, you know, you care. Oh, a citadel. My my, we're getting big now. <laughs> uh, more of that. Now I don't think I want to put my shooters up there. Good enough. Or try what I die, because I don't have resurrection. Um let's see. So 270 plus whatever 27 times 4 is. A little bit over a hundred. Heyo! Death. Oh, that's just uncalled for. I mean, who throws his shoe? Seriously. Ah, uh, he couldn't even get a drawbridge lowered for me. Would I kill? I'd get a lot of damage. But let's uh, abuse the harpies even more. 551, 21, yeah, I'll do it. Excellent. I must say that I am liking these outcomes. Well, <laughs> I have a, my pick between two reasonably good skills. I will take offense. Thank you, Milkit. You've done a decent job. Go home. Um, do I want a castle here? Or do I just want to stop off? Pretty well developed city here. I think I'll just stop off though. Need ore still. 
But I'll get it. I'll get all the resources I need um, by next turn, actually. So I'm not building anything. We're going to get Daggerons. And that's going to be awesome. Incoming Daggerons. Alright, get out of here, imps. We'll even buy one. Get a couple next week as well, but they will not be free. They'll probably not even be inexpensive. Yeah, level 14. She'll make it. She'll make it. Okay. Not sure what's going on here. Oh, this is from getting cover of darkness. That's the other route. Man, I want a piece of that dragon utopia. <laughs> I want it badly. Oh yeah, follow your course. I really wanna oh. Well how about that? I'm gonna snipe another city. It's not even worth the gold. Yeah, I don't know. Um, this doesn't seem very hard. I guess technically I was supposed to play this right after Armageddon's Blade. Because, you know, if you follow like the Dungeons and Devils pattern, like uh, in terms of where you would click, then, uh, yeah, this would be the first campaign you'd play after that. And it's certainly more reasonable <laughs> in a lot of ways than, say, playing with fire or something of that nature. And yeah, my troglodytes are becoming increasingly close to obsolete here. 156, and I'm just gonna bless them again. The damage range is just amazing. So, might as well get bless on them. And yet, the exact same pattern, we're even going to... Ooh! The anti-morale hacks, that's... Yeah, that's not good. That's not good at all. What are my defenses? Can I reach? No, I cannot. So more haste. More destruction. We'll just follow the exact same pattern again. Probably should have shot the troglodytes before as well. And we're good. Lost fewer because there were fewer enemies. Duck in here for another week of or another magic. I can get more troops too, actually. So I will do so. I'm actually gaining troops other than my troglodytes, which... Yeah, they're expendable. Don't tell them I said that, though. You know, we get strikes and workers' unions and other problems that... It just gets ugly. And they get lawyers breathing down their necks, and... It shows up on the bottom line ledger. It's, it's not good. It's a bad experience. Ha 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 ha! I'm an AI. Seriously, though. <laughs> now that I'm sufficiently confused. Alright. We good? We good? Good to go south? Nope. Yeah, I'm just trying to pick up. Uh, cheesy monsters. See what I can do. And I got the orcs, but I could easily replace them. And I'm surprised that I took a morale hit there, because usually you don't take morale hits for just having one troop of the differing alignment. Alright, you're... You know what, I'm gonna kill him with my primary hero. I, I don't know why the game is doing that, but... <laughs> Maybe it's some kind of bug. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to blow any more money here. We're good. Oh, you know what I do want to blow some money that was recruiting here? Um, basically, I'm just going to keep my defenses here up. Make it hard for the AI to do anything. And... 
anything to you do maybe you can upgrade well I, I can't I can't buy anything new black market sounds awesome let's do it some of the Oswald Orwald's forces into caverns yeah 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 we're finishing here do I have a time limit be useful to know no no time limit <laughs> that thing just looks cool and costs and fortune is any of this stuff particularly useful to me do I have any artifacts no just wow I don't need it that badly geez Give me some troops. These guys don't have a lot. Alright. Might as well funnel some troops into Gruen Point. Looks like the only way I could lose now is uh, if Tan breaks out. I don't even see where Green's uh, getting his forces any longer. But they lost their mains, so it's not like it's... But that really takes pressure off when the enemy loses their mains and they can't threaten yours. That's, you know, those two things together. Pretty nasty. Okay, so I got a marketplace. Should build a marketplace here. I'm going to start trying to pump my mage guild since I am back in the area. Let's see if we can get it to level 4 or 5. I really only care about 4. I mean, I'd love to get a level 5 mage guild as much as the next guy, but... That's not what matters right now. What matters right now is town portal. So let's see if we're capped. Moment of truth, right? <laughs> we are not. So I have a distinct possibility of abusing town portal to no end on this map. Yep, just send some harpies over. Huh. I really don't have much use for you. I guess I'll send you up here. Great, now where did he go? He'd send one person that way and one person in this direction. Let's cast a spell. Okay, so if they went this way, I got them. Alright. Well, good. Tan. Clavius. I'm jealous just because he gives gold per turn. You know what? We'll build a portal of summoning. Just for the little bit of extra oomph. It's probably gonna be like troglodytes, but who cares. Any small amount to help me out. Oh good. Give it with that. <sighs> Move up. Now my opponent has some in tactics as well. Actually, dungeon overlords tend to get tactics. Who is this? Lorelei. I forget her specialty, but... Ooh, that's right. I can get access to mass haste. And of course, she can get access to mass slow. I'm actually going to wait and see what they do. Oh my god, that hurt. What's your stats? Not that impressive. Well. Screw you too. This is when double moving comes into play. Wow. Huge damage spread as usual. Now we'll mass bless for max damage. Abusive much? Probably. Do I care? Nay, I say. Ah, come on, finish those harpies. Fine, the orcs will finish the job. 
There we go. Finally, some useful artifacts on Muterra. It's been really rare for her to get anything. Um, yeah, we'll go with expert level because expert level is awesome. Why are there lots of Iron Guard ones there? Yeah, that was a big victory for me. We'll pick up some Minotaurs next round. Alrighty. Looking good. Looking good. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, Seth and Roth. <laughs> Maybe next map. <laughs> Watch, in Shadow of Death, there's gonna be like an entire campaign featuring Seth and Roth. Or like, she's gonna carry over and become like, hands down, my best hero, bar none. No exceptions. Something like that. And it's just gonna be stupid. And that's just so many Medusas. <sighs> Three to five, one to four. That's why the damage variant. It's a huge damage variance. Like, that's crazy. No, Charlie. No, but seriously, that's like insane. And yeah, this guy's uh, really not superior to me, other than in numbers. And when heroes are not that much different, <laughs> numbers make a big difference. You thought I was going to let you in, but I'm going to fly back. Screw you. I mean, maybe I'd get, like, uber lucky or something, and, uh... Yeah. They can't throw get down the gates, so the arrow towers just gouge them, but... My opinion is that is not tremendously likely. Poke. Although I will inflict some good casualties here. Actually, I could play the uh, running game too. Because my opponent will not have a lot of shots. But the garrison tower has a lot of shots. I don't know, I never seem to be able to win these when I really want to. <laughs> like, it's like, has notions, and then the AI finds a way to kill me anyway. Um. Hello. Yeah, they don't seem too inclined to get out of the moat, so I'm just gonna shoot them in the moat. Yeah, if the AI runs out of shots, I'm going to win. Well, it depends on how quickly they bombard, too. <laughs> Come here, Medusas. I know you guys are still in the mode, so we'll do that. The Garrow Garrisons have like 99 shots, they won't run out of shots. So I, I think I just want to milk. Oop. Want to milk them for max damage. Yeah. Um. Sure. Well, let's run a bless. And pop out on the troglodytes. Stop shooting those. Those don't have the defense drop, and they're not, they're like so low on the threat priority right now. You can't really reach the Medusas properly, so you just die. Yeah, I'm just kind of blocking here. Maxing out some damage. 118, I actually killed a decent chunk that way. Yeah, okay. Let's rough these suckers up. Run some buffs. Ha ha. Go home, get stoned. I'm gonna actually hold this off. I will win. How about that? It's a rather unexpected and fortunate outcome. 
Oh, now I got stoned. I got double stoned. T -t 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 Triple stoned! Yeah, I actually have more beholders than they have now. So this is game, set, match. Especially because sooner or later they're going to run out of their shots. Stop picking up my harpy, jerks. <laughs> now they're going to take out my garrison. Too late. Not bad. All right. <laughs> I think I'm about to win the map. Surprisingly. <laughs> Except for I need to build up my town portals. Or try to get town portal. At all costs. Such a priority. And we will just... Yeah, I forget how many gems I need. Something like this. Should be good enough. Yep. Lady Luck does not like me. These aren't terrible, but they're really not what you're looking for. Or what I'm looking for. But at any rate, run home. And we'll just build up the next mage guild. Lar using largely money at this point. Um, yeah, the first thing we'll do is shore up defenses. The AI losing there really crippled it. <laughs> Forcing it to run like that. That's pretty much game over. I probably have it bottled up already. And I'm going to take advantage of that. And who is, uh... Okay, here we go. Let me step aside. Time to build up the mage guilds. First we'll recruit troops. Then we'll build up mage guilds. So I want to make sure I at least have enough for my troops. And man, she is slow. I guess like having orcs in her party or really uh, troglites are slow too. She has expert wisdom. And maybe I should. Uh, maybe I should build up a level 5 mage guild everywhere. Because uh, implosion would just be that good. Or having access to it for early game shenanigans would be that good. But I think getting Town Portal first for the flexibility that offers is my priority number one. So, um, yeah, I'll just buy some resources. What the heck? Doesn't really matter what. I'm just gonna spend money on them each turn until I have them. <laughs> uh, yeah, we could use a Mercury. Just get a bunch of Mercury. It's not an exciting way, but it gets the job done. Okay. Oh, that's why I had these guys still. I don't need any of this stuff anymore. It was good while it lasted. It helped me out. We had a good run. But it's over. Can I take on a Dragon Utopia with these forces? I probably can. Probably can. A lot of Minotaurs, a lot of Manticores. And while I can't do any direct damage spells to the dragons, although if I had Implosion I could, um, it's not terribly important. No, you know what? Let's show off our new toys. You guys gave me such trouble at the start of the game. <laughs> Everybody wait. Yeah, chew on that. What now? Some decent experience. I already got the imp cash. I never did look above here. Am I being blocked? Oh, whatever, just go that way. And, uh, what else do I need? I could use some gems. Yeah, we'll get some more. 
Silver. Sulfur. Silver Sulfur. Silver Surfer. Something like that. It's all the same. Okay, next level Mage Guild, please. Can get even another level Mage Guild before I have to buy more stuff again. Herper Derpa! And my hero is still trolling me by moving at like negative three miles an hour. And I could, I was wrong. I need six of each thing. Except for uh, the base resources stay at five. Well, okay. Have it your way, game. And, uh, yeah, just take some more troops. We're actually uh, a couple weeks ahead of the AI, unless he gets better stuff. In this case, we're not. <sighs> Why am I doing this? I don't know either. I don't even need magic. I'm just gonna one-shot everything. New battle doors. I think I get better uh, rewards for killing stuff that's defended with battle doors. Well, it's 2,000 experience. It's not terrible. And okay. What, what, what's, what, what's going on here? Why can I not reach this? I can. Isn't it the dragon scale shield? Oh wow, that would have been useful. Did they like make there no open ground so even if you got Dimension Door you couldn't get through? Ha! <laughs> That's pretty cool. No, but seriously, how do I get over here? I can apparently walk there. Oh, I have to fight my way past the gogs and I can get down here. Whatever, we'll do that. I need like eight of everything now. How about 18? Like 18? No, but we're gonna switch to auto combat. So that I don't have to fight, but I can still get some experience. We're gonna be uber lazy. Yes. Huh, nothing particularly great. I mean, leadership's fine, but not, don't care a lot. Ooh, tough call. I'll take archery, though. And will she... No, I will not max out what skills on this level. Unless I get, like, a bunch of scholars or something. Which, skill scholars now wouldn't be bad, because now they can't give me anything terrible. Which they certainly could do before. Alright, I'll be able to get a mage guild next turn. Whoa, where did this happen? Where where did I see that hero? I saw a hero somewhere. <sighs> Fine. I'm pretty sure it's in view, so view air should work. You're my home base, huh? Now oh, here we go. Trying to use uh, blending in tactics. But you can't fool me. I have Ulema. And hopefully money. <laughs> oh jeez. I'm a little shy on the funds. I wonder if you can attack me effectively though. Probably not. Dragon's a pretty high uh, defense skill here. Doesn't this carry over? That's why I came here. <laughs> yeah, apparently. I forget what this even does. That's a pretty good item. 
Let's wear it. Alright, Tan. You and your troll lol, 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 powers are going to go down here. Troglodyte. <laughs> Level 2. Save. I haven't saved in a while. It's probably a good idea to save, just in case things go wrong with the recording. Yeah! Took losses, but didn't use effort. That's my kind of thing. Well, next turn I can actually... Do I not have resource silos? Oh man. I have to even buy sulfur. It's terrible. Whatever. I oh, know, I have re one resource silo somewhere. Good. Ah! Actually, uh... Meteor Shower is not useless to me. I don't have good spell power, but you get a pretty good multiplier for having expert earth magic for it. Um, <laughs> apparently if I can get, uh, Dragon Geddon going. But I don't have the sorcery or other things that would make Dragon Geddon reach its potential. Nevertheless, let's pick these spells up. How is she on magic? Yeah, we'll spend a turn in here. And since the AI blew its attack again, I once again don't really have to worry about uh, my forces down to the southwest. Hmm. Maybe I want to take on that Dragon Utopia. Maybe. I don't want to take it on with auto combat, though. <laughs> that would go poorly. That would absolutely max my level, though. Uh, let's go that way. I'll build up my mage guild over here too, and if I'm fortunate, maybe I'll be able to make something happen with that. Yeah, this isn't the most exciting stuff ever. In fact, viewers, uh, let me do us both a favor. I'm going to meet you back when, uh, well, I'm going to actually cut the video here. And basically do what I did with the Festival of Life scenario where I'm just going to come back once I have secured the map and you know, I'll show some points of interest, things I pick up along the way and I'll show my status before I end everything with some magic editing and then we'll go to the next scenario in the next part. So thumbs up if you like this video and I will see you then. The Me and Team signing off.